Shalom. I'm going to start off by giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rakakadash. Give honors to our elders and apostles for teaching us his truth and his Bible. And Shalom to all you brothers pushing his word to the best your ability. Yeah, man. So, you know, it's in my spirit today, you know, these scriptures, you know, the basically, man, the Lord hears, hears our prayers, man. You know? So you, you you ever if you ever you know get some demons in your head telling you you know hey the Lord ain't hearing you you know you know yeah hey, it's it's about it's about what we pray for too man we're just, we're not supposed to be praying for all this these carnal crap man you know we're supposed to be praying for uh kingdom like stuff you know the wisdom man you know all that uh all the uh, all the all the the, uh, the glory all the the stuff you know that you want. And this side, man, we gotta wait for the other side, man. You know, so it's uh second Edris eight and twenty-four. Oh, hear the prayer of thy servant and give ear to the petition of thy creature. God, so you know, just like Edris, you know, asking asking the Lord the Lord, you know, to hear hear his prayer, man. You know? That's that's the same same as us. You no. Know? There's a scripture that uh What's it say? Uh, to prepare thyself before prayer, you know. We prepare ourselves. We want to, uh, you know. We want. We of course we want the Lord to to hear our prayers, man. You know, of course we want you help us, Mel to hear our prayers. We gotta, uh, yeah, but you know, we can't let those demons plague your mind, making you think that he ain't hearing it. You know, cause hey, that's why you, these this uh this lesson gotta come out, you know. Got some uh scriptures on that, man. You know, the most high hears us, man. So don't even uh don't let Satan get to you on that. It's uh first Peter three and uh twelve. For the eyes of the Lord are over the righteous, and his ears are open unto their prayers. Come. So you no, know, so we're trying to we're trying to show the the Most High, you know, that we're, uh, you know, we're trying to be righteous, you know, we're trying to, trying to do, to the best of our ability, you know, in this this, this tacky flesh that we in, you know, we're trying to do to the best of our ability, you know, and uh, we try we try to be righteous to the best of our ability, you know, try to follow the 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 laws to the best of our ability, you know, try to uh try to Trying to get better, you know. Trying to correct, correct, uh, correct flaws that we have, you know. You know, cause that's pleasing to the Most High. You know, this uh, this First Peter three and twelve, for the ears of the Lord are over the righteous, and His ears are open unto their prayers. God, so you know, point, you know, and the point is, is He hears us, man. You know. Yahweh Shmuel Shai hears us. It says, uh, but the face of the Lord is against them that do evil. Come. So, you know, we just try, like I said, try to do the best of our ability, you know. Stay away from that, uh, that evil, you know. So, let's see, uh. Because then, you know, most of I ain't trying to hear none of that. You doing, uh, you doing evil. You know, it says uh, Proverbs 15 and 29. The Lord is far from the wicked, but he heareth the prayer of the righteous. Come, but he heareth the prayer of the righteous. Yo, he hears, man. You know, he hears our prayers, man. You know, scripture I like to always bring out the uh, uh, in Sirach, you know, prayer, uh, you know what? Let's grab it. We'll come back to this. So rock thirty-seven. Hold on, slot. Gone. Is Sirach 35 and 16. 
He that serveth the Lord shall be accepted with favor, and his prayer shall reach unto the clouds. The prayer of the humble pierceth the clouds. Gone. So as I was talking about earlier, you know, preparing ourselves before, before we make the prayer, you know. Yeah, come humbly. Because as I said, the, the Most High resisteth the proud. You know. It says, uh, the prayer of the humble pierceth the clouds. You know, so basically just, just shoots through the, the clouds, man, you know. Pierce it the clouds, and till it come nigh, he will not be comforted, and will not depart to the Most High. So behold, to judge righteously and execute judgment. Okay, so let's uh, go back. Let's go back. This is a uh, Proverbs fifteen and twenty nine. The Lord is far from the wicked, but he heareth the prayer of the righteous. Come. So that's the point of this lesson, you know. Y'all by Shema Shai, here's, here's our prayer, man. You know. It says, uh, let me see. But, you know, if you calling on the, if you calling on the wrong name, you know, you ain't gonna hear that. You know, you gotta be calling on the right, the right names, you know. Yahweh. Which is the 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 most highest name, you know, who you ignorantly call God and Bahashem, you know, in the name, you know, Yahweh Shai, which is his son or Lord, you know. So that is a uh, those those are the names you to be praying on. Are you praying on uh? What well, Yeshaya, Yahuwah, those names, hey, he ain't gonna, he ain't gonna hear that, you know. On a, on a lower level, you know, just like if uh, if say your name was John, you know, but somebody keeps calling you uh, Mike, you're not gonna respond to that, will you? You know how much more, the, how much more you held by Shmuel Shai. This is Proverbs eighteen and ten. The name of the Lord is a strong tower. The righteous runneth into it and is safe. Come on, so, so the name of the Lord is a strong tower, you know. We call it on his, on Jehovah Shem Yoshai, you know. I said, man, these prayers are, are, are coming true a lot quicker nowadays, you know. Which will show you that we really ain't got much time, time in this place. This is, uh... Proverbs 18 and 10, the name of the Lord is a strong tower. The righteous runneth into it and is safe. All right, so the elect are going to run into the, the right names, man. You know, the elect is not going to be calling on no, on no, uh, Jesus the Christ, you know. Yahuwah, Yeshua, just like you're saying, man. This is, uh, I'm going to finish off with this, you know. So this is slack here. So this is James one and six. But let him ask in faith nothing wavering, for he that wavereth is like a wave of the sea, driven with the wind and toss. God, so you know, when we ask, you know, we can't be all iffy, you know, like a like a like a damn female. No, oh, maybe not, huh? Will he answer? Maybe will he answer the the prayer, huh? No, huh? You know, we gotta, we gotta be be uh, be uh, what do you call firm? You know, like, you know, yeah, I uh, yeah, I have faith. You know, he'll answer this prayer. You know, it says uh, but let him ask in faith, nothing wavering, for he that wavereth is like a wave of the sea, driven with the wind, and toss. For let not that man think that he shall receive anything of the Lord. Come on. So we, we wavering, you know. You ain't going to receive nothing. You're not going to receive what you're asking for. You know. Okay, come on. A double-minded man is unstable in all his ways. Come on. So, you know. 
you over here, oh, maybe he will answer or maybe he won't. You know, that's double-minded. You know, you just got to be straight, straight with it. You know, I, I have faith the most I will answer my prayer. You know, can't be all shaky. You know, say, so, hey, man, it's, uh, someone said, the Wadi Yahweh by Shemuel Shai for putting the Holy Spirit on me to call I should do this lesson. Double honors to our elders and apostles for teaching us the truth of this Bible. And shalom to all you brothers pushing this word to the best of your ability. Shalom.